In this question, we're asked to make x the subject. Now, we need to gather all the x's on the left-hand side and everything else on the right-hand side. And we can see we've got this x inside the brackets here. So the first thing we need to do is to expand these brackets. So I'll have ax minus 5y on the left equals, we've got this b term multiplied by the x. That will give us bx. And we've got the b multiplied by the 3y. So we've got plus 3by. We can now deal with this bx term. I want this on the left-hand side. So I can subtract bx from the right-hand side to eliminate it from the right. I'd also have to subtract bx from the left. So I am subtracting bx from the right and subtracting bx from the left. So I've got ax minus bx. I've still got this minus 5y equals. These bx's have cancelled and I'm just left with the 3by. I can now eliminate this minus 5y. And to do that, I would have to add 5y to the left. And if I add 5y to the left, I must also add 5y to the right. So what am I left with? I've got this ax minus the bx. The 5y's have cancelled equals 3by plus the 5y. Now I've got an ax here and a bx here. Can't add them, can't subtract them. What I need to do is to factorize. So the x here is in each of these terms. So we do have a common factor. So I can bring the x outside a bracket here. x multiplied by a gives me the ax minus x multiplied by a b would give me the bx. And that is equal to 3by plus the 5y. The last step is to eliminate this here, this a minus b term. Now that's multiplied by the x. So all I need to do is to divide by a minus b here and also divide by a minus b on the right hand side. Dividing by a minus b on the left let me just write it out in full then. So we're actually dividing by a minus b here, and we're going to divide by a minus b here. Well, this a minus b here cancels with this one, so I'm just left with the x, and that is equal to 3by plus 5y, and that's over a minus b. If you found this video useful, then remember to give me a quick thumbs up. And if you would like to be notified when I release new videos, then hit that subscribe button and remember to click on the little notification bell.